Ray and Lourdes, those three teens were brought here to Stroger Hospital in good condition. Community activist Andrew Holmes tells us he believes those teens are still here. Now, he spoke to us this evening about the number of shootings we've already seen in these two days into the new year. We're starting off in the red zone, that's for sure. I mean, nothing has calmed down since last year. Community yeah, activist Andrew Holmes says he's been so, staying busy these past couple of days, meeting with families impacted by violence and shootings across the city. Today's latest incident is a triple teen shooting. Police say it was just before four this evening when three teens were standing on the sidewalk in the 1400 block of South Springfield when an unknown vehicle pulled up and an unknown suspect inside of the vehicle fired shots. Two 13-year-old victims sustained a gunshot wound to their left hand and a 14-year-old victim was shot in the left arm. All three victims were taken to Stroger Hospital in good condition. Stable can be stable. They can come out here with permanent damage. Permanent damage to their arms, permanent damage to their hands. The search continues for the suspect. First and foremost is to help for these individuals in here. Second is to make sure that there's no retaliation behind this. And third is just to reach this family and see what we can do to help enhance or guide these individuals and overall working with families during a difficult time to those individuals of this family and their friends just stay prayerful uh, we all can work together i mean around this city to end this madness and this gun violence area four detectives are investigating this case for now reporting live from stroger hospital christine flores wgn news